D Bailey. Good. I'm here with Corey. He wasn't ready for this shot. But we, we are we're here. Corey, you can just slide over just a little bit here. Corey getting the picture. Yeah. We have two beer reviews. Let's try not to lean on the table because it's shaking. Now, I've been gone for a while, but I'm back. Here we have the first tasting. It's going to be watermelon. What do they call it? Goza. Goza. That's how it's pronounced in the back. And it's called Watermelon Goza. It's by Terrapin Beer Company out of Athens, Georgia. Now, let's see. Wow. It has a recycling thing on it. What I do, what, oh, it is 4.5% alcohol by volume, which is already a problem. <laughs> but Corey's going to be fantastic today. As you see, the sun was out, and Corey has his guns out. <laughs> now, you're shaking the table. Sorry. I have mine out, too. Now, I have my other brother, James, can't be here because he, he is atrophying. He, so he cannot be with us today because he is atrophying. He knows he's atrophying. He's going to try to get his form back next year after he takes his black belt test. <laughs> but the sun's out, gun's out for me. Sun's out, gun's out for Corey. James, sorry you had to sit this one out. <laughs> we'll see you next time. First, we'll do the tasting. Take Corey? The same time? Or... Yeah. Oh, okay. Good golly. <laughs> Just don't taste anything like watermelon. This <laughs> tastes like Duke. Oh, Corey. Please, <laughs> tell us your expression, Corey. Extremely bitter. Extremely it, bitter. There's nothing watermelon in it. There is no watermelon here. <laughs> no, and as you can see citrus. the can, you can see the can. It looks like a daggone watermelon. <laughs> now, Corey, do you like this beer? Mm-mm. Uh, now, I'm going to give it another shot. I get, I, sometimes your pal has to adjust. <laughs> Has nothing that's too bitter. Oh, good God. This is a tart. <laughs> a tart beer. It is... It, it says refreshing. I can't call it. I, man, this beer is ice cold, but it tastes like it's lukewarm. <laughs> right or wrong? Yeah, it tastes... And, yeah. oh my... Check this out. Goose Ah. A traditional German-style beer brewed with sea salt and coriander. Now, when it says watermelon goose ah, I would assume the gooza or the watermela would mean it tastes like watermelon. And think. watermelon, it does not. Casey, stop it. My dog is attacking the fence. He thinks he's tougher than he is, but he's not tough at all. Now, that Corey, uh -huh. I, I don't give this beer. This is a very deceiving beer here. It is very deceiving. There's no. It is very deceiving. It, it says watermelon, but it says it's brewed with sea salt and coriander. Now, if you like yourself a salt beer, you go ahead and take this up all day. You like a tart and salty beer. It doesn't taste like watermelon. The whole thing was like watermelon. You give this a try. To wrap in, watermelon goose ah. I'll say it tastes bad ah. <laughs> I do not like this beer because it's a bad, uh. it, it is a misrepresentation of the product here. Mm -hmm. You know I'm all about product safety, product, uh, you know, I hate false representation. We cannot have this. I'm not gonna buy this again unless I want some salt beer. Unless I'm gonna just unless I'm gonna wash my teeth with some salt solution. But otherwise, I'm gonna have to give this one a no go for me, Corey. No go for Corey, aka Corey.